This is a demonstration on how to do factory calibration of the SkyViper GPS drone. Um, you first of all need to connect to the web interface of the drone and then choose the calibration uh, option. Within the calibration option, you will find a combined tab. This is the factory calibration tab. It shows you the status of all of the relevant sensors. It also shows you, um, it has a single button for doing a complete calibration. With this one button, it will do calibration of the accelerometers and the magnetometer and the per motor calibration. The latitude and longitude should be automatically remembered from the previous time you did a calibration or it will get it from GPS lock if it is available. So you should not need to enter these numbers each time. The direction is the direction that the drone is pointing. The drone must be um, level. Um, it must be pointing in the direction indicated by the direction uh, entry box here. So zero means true north, 90 would mean pointing east, 180 would mean pointing south. And of course, 270 would mean pointing west. You can choose any direction as long, but I would suggest you set it up with north. Um, the latitude and longitude must be approximately right. It doesn't need to be exactly right. It just has to be within, you know, uh, a few tens of kilometers. The drone must, must not be near metal. So it must be on either a plastic or wooden table, well clear of metal objects, including table legs, chairs, metal on the operator's body. You need to have it well clear of metal for correct magnetometer calibration. It must also be prevented from moving. Um, the simplest method is to place the drone on a rubber mat uh, so that there's enough friction to stop it rotating. Uh, as long as the surface has some friction, it won't move. Alternatively, you can strap down the drone, but that takes time. So I would suggest just using a rubber mat. You must keep your hands clear of the propellers and uh, the calibration is finished when all four motors have spun. So to do a calibration, you go to the combined tab and you press the one button. It then does the accelerometer calibration, the magnetometer calibration, and it is now doing the motor calibration. Uh, it is now spinning each of the motors. I'm not sure if you can hear it with my microphone. Uh, when it's finished spinning the motors, it will say calibration complete, like it said there, and the calibration is now done. 